What is up everybody? It is Dead Storm here. I'm bringing you another Quantum of Solace gameplay. What I want to talk about today is actually very complex. When I first thought of it, I was like, Dead Storm, it's simple. You can't get anywhere with it. But I do what people in the Navy do. I nuked it. I thought too much into it. And here's the result. What I want to talk about is perspectives and how important perspectives are in our view of the world and, well, how the world is today. Perspectives are complicated because so many things can be factored into them. It's not only just one thing. If you're a two-year-old child, for example, you're going to have a different perspective than an adult. A two-year-old child doesn't know as much about the world as an adult does. In the general stereotype, of course, we have those genius children and those not-so-smart adults. I'm not meaning to insult anybody. I'm not calling anybody out. But we have those situations. A two-year-old child is going to have a different perspective based on their height, based on their location, and what they're feeling at the moment. You know, perspectives can always change, especially for a child, just based on their emotion. For example, a child plays with the toy, gets yelled at one moment. They're going to have a bad perspective about playing with that toy. But they play with the toy... And they get praised for it. Now, that's obviously not good parenting, but you get my point. Then they're going to enjoy playing with the toy. They, they'll want to play with it more to impress their parents. It's a different perspective and a different viewpoint. To branch off what I was saying earlier, a child's perspective is not as complex as an adult's. It's more based off the necessities such as sleep, hunger, and entertainment. You know, if a child's not playing a lot and not enjoying themselves, they're going to have a more negative perspective. It's not based on the worldwide concept. They really don't care about external affairs. It's more of a selfish perspective at the moment, but, you know, that is a child. Their eyes will broaden, you know, and these are big building blocks for the perspectives that they'll have in the future. Your very own perspective can be influenced by the perspectives of those around you and the actions of those around you. For example, you have your parents who pass along their thought processes that you might take on yourself and believe to be true just based on the perspective that they give you, based on the actions that they do, and based on the influence they have in shaping your personality. You know, your th thought process, your personality might change in the future your perspective itself might change in the future just based on experiences outside the family but for the moment they mostly shape your opinion whether you like it or not uh, it's a stereotype a lot of you guys are going to say well dead storm i'm retaliating i'm a rebel well, you can have a negative perspective just based on the fact that you believe a lot of your parents stuff to be bullshit we have the single mother, the abusive stepfather, college girl, and single man. All of them have different perspectives of the world and are all in different parts of their life. The single mother has to work three jobs to support her children. They have to stay after school to do their homework. She picks them up. She makes them dinner, gets them ready for the next day of school, makes their lunch, takes them to school, works her jobs, works on the weekends, make sure that her sister watches over the kids and she does it all so she can have her children or her child and she thinks of it as rewarding she comes home to her children every day and tells them that she loves them her perspective is that life is tough but it's rewarding for the abusive stepfather the world is cruel he tries to escape his childhood but it's always behind him he always thinks about it at night he beats the child he finds satisfaction in it his perspective is negative. For the college girl, she's had the same dream since high school. She's now in college following that dream. There is so much ahead of her, so much potential. She can't wait. She is happy. And finally, the single man. He is an adventurer. He wants to do many things in his life. He cannot have a woman pull him down. He wants to explore the world and enjoy everything as it comes. And those are all examples of different perspectives and how different paths in life have made them the people that they are. 
one last thing I want to mention before I end this commentary. Perspective, as I said, depends on location. Location is a big deal because we have such things as religion and culture. And that's why I think perspectives are different. For example, we have the Muslims and their different views, and we have the Catholics with their different views. And they view each other differently because of that, if that made any sense. Perspectives definitely shape how wars are fought, and they shape how countries are made. That's it for this commentary. I hope you guys did enjoy. If you did, please leave the video a like rating. Have a great day, guys, as I will too. Peace, guys.